just nothing you wanted or yeah, uh, I mean, or nothing you know there's like a, just thousand, wasn't a yeah. thousand people in the portal yeah and about 10 of them are good enough to play for us uh -huh. i mean they're they're in the portal because they're you know they weren't getting playing time right, right. that's why they're usually in the portal so right. how hey buddy how are you good to see you good to see you um so th and then we really didn't couldn't get a one, two, or three because we're so right. heavy at that position. Right. So we were really only looking at four and five, and now it takes you down to about three kids in the country. Uh -huh. And you know, quite honestly, our salary cap wasn't as good as other people's. <laughs> you know? that's I mean, true. you know, I mean, that's what it comes down to yeah. for a lot of kids that are in the portal is they want a lot of money. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, what uh, What do you hope to get out of this trip? Um, for me, these trips are more about the summer extra practices that mm -hmm. you get than over there. Because the competition is so different. Sometimes it's really, really good. You're playing national teams. Sometimes it's awful. Mm -hmm. They're playing international rules. Mm -hmm. You know, to me, the, the competition isn't really what matters. Mm -hmm. It's the practices that you get now mm -hmm. that will help you in, you know, kind of get a head start on the next year. Mm -hmm. To me, when you go overseas, it's about building chemistry, having fun. It's a reward for the players that they get to actually enjoy this experience. You know, for recruiting, it's nice that recruits know, hey, they go on a foreign trip once every four years, mm -hmm. yeah. and it's really fun. But it's about chemistry and memory building for me. Kate says you are a meticulous planner of trips yes. like this. <laughs> um, what, what are some of the things you've got planned for them? Oh, my goodness. Um, I do. I really like to plan travel. Okay. Uh, but we do have a travel company that we work with, and so they handle all the hotels and the right. games and all that logistics so of that. Um, but we're we're gonna have a cooking class in Italy. Oh boy. Um, so yeah, I think that's a great way to bring people together, sure. right? In the kitchen and then having that meal together. So I think that'll be really fun. Um, we're gonna go to the Isle of Capri. Um, in in uh, Dubrovnik, we're going to go kayaking. Um, we're gonna go zip lining and split. So we've got a lot of really good things planned. You've got a lot of players back, but for some of the new, I mean, still, is, these are the kind of trips that can really bring the players together. Oh, yeah. Even more. Yes, you know, I agree. Because yeah. even though we have a lot of people back, it's still a different chemistry with a new four and five on the floor, right? Mm -hmm. um, so, and then, you know, Kenise is into our fold, and Ava is not going to travel with us. Um, okay. She's had some surgery this summer, um, and she's just a, a little bit unsteady that with all the walking and cobblestones and stuff, we just, yeah. uh, I didn't feel comfortable with that mm -hmm. um, you talk about your fours and fives um, is it gonna be are you thinking kind of post by committee or somebody stepped up that uh, really kind of grabbed that job by the throat not yet uh -huh. I'm hoping that somebody does um, but right now it's still post by committee and you know that could even be one of four people really mm -hmm. I mean it could be Addie Sharon AJ and even Hannah uh -huh. so when I mean, those are the people that we could have at the four and if we put move Hannah the five we'll put Kate at the four I mean Sid and Taylor have been looking good we bring them at the three so we've just got a lot of options uh -huh. you know that we can go to and try is that one of the things with this trip that you want to do is kind of you can tinker you can play around with some different combinations and see what works it is I, I really wanted this summer to see who's gonna jump into that five like who's yeah. gonna really own it and mm -hmm. right now I'm still not there I'm still at the you know that was to me the main thing um, because you know are we gonna have to move hand of the five more or yep. can we keep her at the four and so that's just the, that's still a question for me is it just me or does Shannon look a lot more athletic than she, she uh, Sharon I think uh, Sharon you know, just losing the darn brace yeah, yeah. you know I think mm -hmm. that makes her look more athletic athletic just uh -huh. losing that darn race hi guys Hello. Was, uh, was, was caitlin just Thanks. out today did she have other caitlin does not feel well today. okay yeah, there's a bug was, going around that that's that's exactly what she has and she wanted to stay but i like nope you gotta go so <laughs> especially so. when you're traveling in a week exactly we want to, we don't want anybody else catching it yeah addison could she pick up on what, the way she finished last year? I mean, how much momentum can you gain from that? I thought she had great momentum going in. Like, she played really well for us mm -hmm. in, in the Final Four against, you know, bigger, taller players that we really had to have her step up, and she did. So mm -hmm. I definitely think, you know, she has the head start uh, mm -hmm. because of that. And, mm -hmm. uh, you know, I want her certainly to have the confidence that she played against the best in the, in the country, and she played well. Mm -hmm. Have you seen 